We are living in the world right now where people's self-esteem are depending on the grades. For example, if a person gets good grades, then all the people, including himself, says that I am a genius. But scientists have no opinion about this belief. Science says that even a person who takes low grades can also be a genius. I am sure that you are thinking, but so am I a genius? And my answer is yes if you meet every sign which I am gonna discuss in this video. But before starting this video, I wanted to say that please don't ignore the signs, except one which I will mention in the video. It is because science hardly found the sign which exists in genius people. So I am just requesting you to don't ignore the signs. Science says that if you meet all the signs, then you are 100% pure genius. Not one, two, but nine are all signs. There are much more signs, but I will discuss only 10 signs. I can't discuss all because the video will become lengthy. So here we go. So number one, which I think that most of the people suffer from this is they procrastinate a lot. If you are or was one of them who procrastinate a lot in their work, then this tells that you have more creative power. I am sure that you are thinking, almost every people procrastinate a lot, so why is it a sign of genius? I firstly tell you at the starting point that not one, two, but nine or all signs define yourself a genius, right? And the second is, when we procrastinate, observe yourself, what you do while you procrastinate, observe deeply and you find that at the time of procrastination, you are thinking a lot. Means it can help you to generate ideas. But most of the people don't take action and so they remain an average in their entire life. So number two, which is genetically possible, is blue eyes. If we talk about the population of human beings, those are blue eyes, then the amount of population is 5%. Science says that blue eyes are rare and most of them found in England or British area. Science also says that people who have blue eyes can think differently than other humans. So, if you don't have, then avoid this because it is genetically and you don't have any control to change your eyes. So, it is best to avoid it. Number 3, which is hard for you to believe, is being lazy. Now you are thinking that, are genius being lazy? And the answer is, yes. They are lazy because they spend their whole time finding information and due to this, they experience fatigue. They experience much more tiredness. So, they lie down their couch and rest. If you are one of them who are being lazy, then it is actually a sign of genius if you believe it or not. Also, researchers found out that if a person is too lazy as compared to an average person, then the lazy one is too creative as compared to that. So that's why Bill Gates mentioned in their quote, that is, I choose a lazy person to do a hard job because a lazy person will find an easier way to do it. So we now discuss the next sign of geniusness, that is, be a night owl. If you don't understand what I mean you to say, then this means that genius people sleep late. This is because genius people are the hunger of knowledge and the best hunger of knowledge is in late night. They most of the time don't wake up early. Also, they suffer from a disease called insomnia, which means that lack of sleep. Insomnia affects our productivity level, but the genius people are not affected because they are the hunger of knowledge like a zombie. And yes, I forgot to tell you that they complete their hunger by reading a book, article, implementing something, etc. But not like seeing social media and knowing what your friends are doing. So, if you're one of them who creates the knowledge, then the chances of being a genius will be increased and congrats that you have that habit. Are you feeling excited to know about the sign of genius? If you are, then I'm glad that you are feeling good because this is our purpose to starting a YouTube channel. If you find some time for us, can you please give us feedback so we can improve our skill and able to spread this channel to the entire world. I am not asking for subscribing my channel, just give us feedback in the comment, let me hear your opinions. Anyway, let's jump to the next sign of genius. So number 5, which is necessary to make the sign in yourself right now, because this is a greater difference between a dumb people and a genius people, that is, knowing everything about yourself. Most of the genius people don't think that they are intelligent. In fact, genius people think that they are not improving, they are worthless, which is not true in reality. And every people believe that they are genius, and so, they make many other stupid decisions in their life. For example, which is best for you if you choose only type of life? A job life where you have only a source of income, or a business life where you can generate multiple sources of income? If you think deeply, then a business life is helpful in the long term. But the average people choose a job life, and they think that they can become a millionaire, which is stupid, right? By the way, let's return to our topic. Genius people know everything about themselves 
and only this sign can make you from average people to ace. So let's discuss about the next sign of genius people. And I'm sure that you know believe this sign, but the signs are explained it deeply. That is addiction or something. Genius people addict it very easily, and it is hard for them to remove it. Why? Science said that we have a two brain hemisphere. That is left and right. 90% of people are right-handed, but 10% of people are left-handed, and they have a special skill that is creativity. For now, forget about 90% of population. Left brain is responsible for controlling the right side of the body, and vice versa. But the right brain hemisphere produces much more creative ideas, as well as a chemical called dopamine, which is responsible to affect in positive. Also, dopamine is also responsible for addicting something like playing video games, drawings, etc. It is not necessary that genius people are left-handed. Some can be right-handed. So, if you're addicted to something and you also have the skill to generate creative ideas, then you are listed to a genius people. By the way, let's go to the seventh sign of genius. That is your messy room. Genius people have a messy room. Genius people forget short-term tasks like bringing food, calling friends, etc. It is so because they don't like to spend their energy on short-term tasks. They spend their energy on long-term tasks or save it for the future. Have you ever experienced in your teenager life when your mother become angry because of your messy room? If yes, then there are more chances that you are a genius. The next sign is abusing. If you are that kind of person who abuses a lot to anyone, then this says that you are intelligent. Researchers say that abusing is caused when your vocabulary is awesome than average people. So, I am going to abuse someone. Bye bye. Just joking. The last one, which you get the answer that why some other people don't get married. And now you get it what I am going to say loneliness, right? Yes, it is loneliness. Most of the genius people, like Elon Musk, are introverted. Well, this is because they are hesitant to talk and have a social anxiety. Well, don't combine this reason with Elon. He is single because he doesn't get the time for his family. But let's return to our topic. Genius people are overthinkers. Means in communication, they most of the time find a negative one, which most of the time is wrong. So they lack confidence when talking to a stranger. So these are the signs of genius. I hope you like it. As I mentioned you before, if you feedback us, we will be the most thankful to you. If you want to subscribe my channel for science videos, then you can subscribe. I have an Instagram account. You can connect me on Instagram profile, link in the description. It is not compulsory, I just notified as many of the YouTubers too. And finally, thanks for watching.